Okay, here's something really strange. We had a fixture that has always had some problems with bulbs here. It tends to eat bulbs. Uh, output's always been low, so we were replacing it here with T8s, and we discovered the fixture actually had a T8 ballast in it, and it's been used with T12 bulbs. We bought the fixture. Uh, it was supposed to be electronic T12. We've had it in place for about five years. Uh, has a Sylvania ballast in it that's electronic and it's actually been running T12 bulbs which is really kind of bizarre so just wanted to show somebody it draws 48 watts about 49 volt amperes 0.39 amps 122 volts, say. And so this fixture, we we're, we're relamping with T8s and T8 uh, ballast, and it turned out it already had a T8 ballast in it. And it's one of five or six lamps we have that all have T12 magnetics. And somehow this has got by accident a T12 or T8 ballast in it for electronic, and it's been running for five years. Uh, bulbs that are T12, the wrong bulbs. So what it does, it tends to run pretty low on output, low and light, and we've actually replaced a bulbs on this thing probably every couple of years, way more than often. So it's running low in output, so it's not drawing that much power, 48 watts for two bulbs, but they're pretty darn dim. So I don't think it's been very good for the bulbs. Anyways, this is a weird configuration of uh, a T8 ba electronic ballast running T12 bulbs by accident. And we're going to replace the ballast on this anyways because it usually has been running fairly hot. And uh, we're going to put all GE ballasts in here. But anyways, this is a ballast that is a... T8 electronic ballast that's been running T12 bulbs four foot for the last five years by accident. Runs about 48, 47 watts here. And uh, the only problems I've seen is that output's been low and tends to eat bulbs a little bit more than all.